Well, you've always heard those stories being passed down as we sit around and people start talking, and his name and Rachel's name would always come up. All we knew is that we had a great grandpa who was white and uh, Rachel who was a mulatto woman. He was really, really smitten by her, I can say. She was a very smart woman. She was a beautiful woman. So Rachel was an important uh, figure in the swamps themselves. She was out there, she was uh, supplying them food, she was working as a spy, and she became uh, romantically involved with Newt Knight and eventually, uh, toward the end of the war, began to have children with him. There was genuinely uh, a relationship here that some have characterized as a common law marriage. So even though we know they didn't go to the courthouse and get married, the perception was that they, that they were married in a common law marriage and fathering a you know, mixed race family with her that he didn't hide from. Very, very radical and very dangerous. He made his own rules. If he decided he was gonna have the first interracial community, he did. If he was gonna have an interracial common law marriage, he did. So it didn't matter what other people say. When I was, you know, uh, in college and so forth, you know, I would say things like, well, you know, Newt, he distributed food uh, to starving people and he was known as the Robin Hood of the Piney Woods, but then someone would always come back and say, yeah, but he was married to a black. He was married to a black as if that negated everything. 